hey guys how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to the channel this is epson workforce wf2960 dwf this printer is multifunctional printer you can copy scan print and fast from this printer you can also copy or scan with adf automatic document feeder this printer work with window 10 window vista window 11 window 10 and later on or window 8 connection internet wi-fi network wi-fi direct and with high speed usb cable in terms of the printing speed for this printer 14 print per minute for black and 7.5 for color if you are printing two two sided 6.5 for black and 4.5 for color scan resolution 1200 by 2400 dpi print resolution 4800 by 1200 dpi this printer is using ink 503 or 503 extra large what i want to do is to show you how to connect this printer to wi-fi network to do this you can connect this printer using the printer from the panel or use your mobile device okay basically you need to download epson smart panel so type in epson smart panel this is epson smart panel is already downloaded on my phone so select enable and open it up this is epson smart panel now select next you need to share your smartphone location to connect select next you need to share your device location okay so select so go to permission okay select location so select allow device location allow okay so put select allow then you go back to the epson smart panel now once you've done that then it will start to search for the product so asking us now please wait so basically this is the epson smart panel okay so what you need to do is once you open up the epson smart panel you need to select plus on top of it so once you download epson smart panel select plus on top and you will, you will see this information would you like to check if your product is supported yes or no no because i know that this product you can connect it to wi-fi network so what we need to do now is set up a new product or connect a product already on the wi-fi network so what we are doing here is to set this printer off for the first time then you need to select set up a new product okay you need to share your bluetooth select okay then so switch the bluetooth on okay and the next thing to do is select continue turn on bluetooth on select turn on bluetooth we are you able to turn the bluetooth on yes or no bluetooth could not be enabled open up the setting on the screen so we need to go to the, the smartphone settings go to the settings okay and go to connections then switch the bluetooth on okay so the bluetooth is on okay now we need to go back to the epson smart panel open it up okay now the next thing to do is make sure the product is on on select next so here we go so you find the product you find the product wf2960 select on it are you sure you want to select this product select yes do you want to set up wi-fi for the product select yes okay connect the product to your wi-fi wireless network do you want to use the network shown below select yes wi-fi network password is required select next the password is usually shown on the back of the side of a router or router in document routers documentation select next now it may be called an encryption key or security key select next do you want to confirm the password select yes okay some character are similar in shape so make sure you enter correct one select next so now we need to put the password for the wi-fi network sometimes 
people ask where do you get the information i got the information from the back of the router so i had the information here so what i'm going to do now is to key in the password if you ask you to put a capital letter you need to put a capital letter if you ask you to put a small letter please do the same thing and you can also check back once you put the password you can also select the i sign at the end to see information you are putting if it's correct Okay, and once you put the information finish okay the next thing you need to do is you need to select okay okay and it will show you do you want to connect the printer to the wi-fi select yes okay so now wait until the product wi-fi setting is complete you can see one percent two percent is progressing 20% the printer is actually connected when you look from the printer panel you will see that this printer is already connected okay you can see 100% Wi-Fi setup is complete and smartphone and the product is connected once you see this image we'll show you okay thumbs up and show you that the printer is connected select select next here we go so now this is the printer here and the ink level so open it up it will show you wf 2960 series printer is ready and this is the ink level okay so this is exactly how this work for now you can scan do so many things using your mobile phone now this printer is set up using the mobile device if you're happy with this tutorial please do me a favor like share and subscribe it help the channel thank you very much indeed and stay blessed thank you